We're going to program this Carlton transmitter to the receiver box on this uh, SP7015 stump grinder. This is kind of what it looks like. And um, what we're going to do is uh, down here I took out the uh, receiving unit out of this plastic box here inside. And um, I've got the... Uh, the key in the on position to provide power to the uh, the receiver once we flip the uh, remote on switch up. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to e-stop is down right now. We're going to uh, release the e-stop and then uh, push the up button on the cutter head. At that point we're going to see the uh, yellow LED flashing. Um, down here, we still have the power off on the receiver. Next, we're going to hold this cutter head in the down position, which is actually pushing it up. At the same time, notice the uh, yellow LED is flashing slowly. We push the E stop button down. It starts flashing quickly. And then we have to... Uh, raise the e-stop button up again while I'm hol holding the cutter head up or in the down position which is position is up and then I release at that point the yellow LED starts to flash we're going to turn on the remote control power and down here we see the second light the second LED right there is red which is the link LED and then we're going to hold this setup button down until the green LED starts flashing quickly. Let's see, and I yeah, let me hold it down now. Hold it down. Yeah, it's hard to hard to get my finger in there. Let's try that again. Okay, it's flashing slowly. There goes the quick flash, goes to a solid green light, and it's waiting for a command up this on the transmitter. We push up the cutter head one time, and both LEDs are now green. If you can see, that's hard to see, but they're both green, the uh, status and the link. So now it's programmed, and at this point, um, I believe if we push the e-stop button, push up on this switch here, we're starting to transmit and take take it off the e-stop. We notice this thing pops out here, which means we've got communications going. And um, most of the, uh, the LEDs are green, so we've got two solids on the endpoint, and that's the link, uh, blinking green LED, and the other LED that's off is uh, the fault LED. So, so at that point, everything is looking great. So that's how you go through the uh, programming sequence on this Carlton.